Thank you, Mr. Speaker Pro Tem. I rise to explain my vote. Please proceed. Three minutes. Mr. Speaker Pro Tem, I'd like to start by correcting the record. Um, first of all, to say that this bill, this language has not been vetted is inaccurate and it's not correct. The Senate has heard it in its committees and so have we here in the House. This exact same language. So for the record, I'd like to correct that. And not only that, but we've heard numerous times on this floor, why are we doing these bills over and over? Why are we talking about this subject over and over? And I'm quoting, when we know it's going to be vetoed. That's what we've been told. So to say that we have not discussed this is inaccurate. The reason we are sounding the alarm is because, ladies and gentlemen, there is a crisis at the border. And allow me to employ a little passion here for a moment for every mother and father, for every person, every Arizonan that has been affected by the crime that is pouring across our border, by the illegal activity that is pouring across our border, where people are losing their lives, people are losing their property, they're losing their livelihood. Why? Because the federal government refuses to do its job. The federal government, this administration, and the federal government has turned its back on Arizona. And we as a body here will continue to sound the alarm. And guess what? When the federal government refuses to do its job, the reason that it exists is because we through the states have empowered the federal government to do certain things. One of those is to protect our borders. And when the federal administration refuses to do that, we as states must step in. We as the people must step in to protect our citizens, to protect Arizona families who are suffering at this lawlessness. The Tenth Amendment says that all, that the powers given to the federal government are listed, are enumerated, but the powers that are reserved for the states are not enumerated. And I submit to you that when the federal government refuses to do its job and protect its citizens from foreign invasion, from lawlessness at our border, then we reserve the rights as states to step in and do and protect our people, protect Arizonans, protect American citizens, protect their families, their children, their livelihoods, their property. This is Arizona. And if the federal government refuses to do its job, we step in, We're, this bill allows police officers more tools to do their job. And we will continue to stand tr tall and strong for the people of Arizona. I vote aye, we vote aye.